We were originally started by a group of engineers based at the European Space Agency in the Netherlands. We deliberately uh, opened ourselves up to the possibility of spreading out across different uh, cities and even uh, continents so that we could really get the maximum benefit from all of those different partners. In Japan, our focus is on the developing a rover for the white rover space. We knew from early on that we wanted to have a Japanese rover. Uh, it's a country of high technology and uh, small, intricate precision engineering and uh, also some really impressive global brands that could be sponsors for the mission. So I actively sought out partners in Japan and uh, we were lucky enough to be put in touch with Professor Yoshida from Tohoku University. Professor Yoshida is good at uh, space technology and also the robotics too. He designed the, the rover, which is now our, uh, our baseline mission rover. White Label Space in the coming year, I think you can expect to see more progress with the rover development. And on the lander side, we're quite active in the propulsion system development and uh, we're also quite active in the braking stage of the uh, lunar lander. One more thing I'd like to add is that we're actually expecting to open a branch here in the United States, which is quite a good opportunity for us because we'll have access to uh, ITAR technologies. We're looking forward to becoming uh, the first global GLXP team.